Today, I'll be opening up a $50 comic book mystery box from the god, Mr. Alex Wink Inc. Michael. Stick around. Links is in the building. What's going on everybody? It's your boy DJ Links back in the building, back in effect, and back with another video. This time, another $50 comic book mystery box from my guy, my buddy, my pal, Mr. Alex Winking Michael. This is a $50 box. He put out these mystery boxes and the range was $40 to $150. So we had a $40, a $50, $100, and then a $150. I missed out on the initial drop. Of course, I wanted to get a couple of those $150 comic book mystery boxes boxes sold out instantly Foosh. had to settle for the $50 joint 100 sold out as well they still had some 40s and they still had a couple of 50s and he did a collaboration with Grant's Comics so it was dope the mystery box instead of being launched on IG it was launched on grantscomics.com so that was pretty cool to go there and I was able to cop two so I'm gonna stretch out this concept this is one mystery box coming soon the second $50 comic book mystery box from Mr. Alex Winking Michael now if you remember I got a mystery box from him a couple of months ago a $600 joint and it was one of the best mystery boxes I've ever gotten we hit an ultimate fallout 4 and a CGC 9.6 which is the first appearance of Miles Morales so of course we're not gonna get that because it's a $50 mystery box but my guy is all about the value and packing value into his boxes and of course I got to support my dude so without further ado we are gonna open up this $50 comic book mystery box and see what's inside let's go All right, so boom, we got everything out of the box. What I failed to mention earlier, no matter the price point, 40, 50, 100, or 150, you are guaranteed a slab. So we got our slab, we got, I'll count the rolls, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rolls all in the Mylar Magic. You are guaranteed a slab as well as a signed book. The signed book is right here, it's the first one. We're gonna start it off, $50 comic book mystery box from Alex Winking Michael. Let's go, first book up. What do we got? Uncanny X-Men number 187. 187 on the undercover cop. Number 187 signed right out the gate. I think I opened this backwards. That looks like Chris Claremont signature, COA on the back. Chris Claremont it is. So he signed this on May 22nd, 2022. This document certifies that this item was signed by the person listed below during a private signing or event for IRF Authentics. And IRF Authentics also puts out mystery boxes with everything in those boxes being signed by a creator or artist or whatever it is this one is signed by chris claremont 187 uncanny x-men pretty dope right out the gate next book up what do we have star wars tales of jedi a dark horse freedom nad uprising i don't know anything about Star Wars comics, especially the Dark Horse Star Wars comics. So I don't know if this is a key, if this is whatever, or is it, you know what I mean? I literally know nothing about this book. It's in fantastic condition though. The Mylar makes everything look, look better. I wanna walk around with Mylar so I can look better. Fantastic. Next book up. What do we have? Wow, this is a pretty impressive cover. I believe this is a, uh, what is it called? The Carnage um, Alpha. That's what it is. The Carnage Alpha, blah, blah, blah. Dope cover. I was going to say this looks like a Perillo, but it is not a Perillo. Pretty dope. Next up. Bad, what do we have? The Hands of Shang-Chi, Master of Kung Fu. Number 31, a 25 center, crispy as all hell. I actually have this, but that's pretty dope. Next book up. Bam, <laughs> a crossover play. <laughs> no, <laughs> crossover number one, a blank sketch cover. I could care less about that. Next book up. Bam, Demon Days number one. This is the Argerm variant for uh, Peach Momoko's Demon Days X-Men. I actually have this as well, but that's pretty cool. The last raw book out of this $50 comic book mystery box, then we'll get to the slab. Last raw. Oh, snap. 
So I moved the monitor. In the last video, I was saying about, hey, so I moved the monitor so I can see this is a gorgeous Action Comics cover. What do we have here? Action Comics number 405. Fantastic Superman cover. Like all like, ah! The assassin has broken through every one of your traps. Not even you, Superman, can save the president from... From who? From, I, it doesn't say. Who can Superman not save the president from? This is dope. This is super dope. Now we have the Slabby Patty, or the Slabby Boy. I'll show you, it's in a 9.8. All right, what do we have? Weapon H number one from May 2018, a KRS Comics Edition D in a CGC 9.8 white pages. This is a convention exclusive, gorgeous cover. Gorgeous, gorgeous cover. Wow. Tyler Kirkham cover. Yeah, this, <laughs> this is fucking fantastic. Sorry for my language. Wendigo appearance, Doctor Strange cameo on last page, Incredible Hulk 345 cover homage. Greg Pak story. This is a phenomenal cover. I need to get up on Weapon H. Haven't read that story, but it's definitely on my short list of things to read. I'll show you once again. That is pretty sick. I am happy with that, especially coming out of a $50 comic book mystery box. So we got that, I am happy. This Action Comics, I am happy. Demon Days, I have that already. This crossover, I'm not a fan of getting blank uh, covers inside of a mystery box. Shang-Chi, that's pretty dope, I have that. Extreme Carnage Alpha, I think it is. That's a fantastic cover. I have no idea what this Star Wars Tales of the Jedi book is about. If this is a key or anything, let me know down below in the comments. It is crispy as hell, I can tell you that. And then last but certainly not least, is Uncanny X-Men number 187, signed by Chris Claremont, which is absolutely fantastic. He did also throw in some stickers, which I have a bunch of winking stickers. So we have the my Lord Out of Its Mind sticker, the classic Wink Ink Avatar logo sticker, Boardroom Certified, a little baby, uh, who's that, Hawkeye, a uh, little baby Okoye, the Winky Pie, classic Winky Pie, and then of course the Secret Wars homage, Secret Wars 8 homage of Wink Ink. That's pretty dope. You know what? Let me show you closer because that sticker is absolutely fantastic. So. That's all the stuff out of this $50 comic book mystery box. I'm pretty sure the value is there. That's not even a question, but what's the total value of this box? And that's gonna do it for me, ladies and gentlemen. As always, subscribe, like, hit that notification bell, share this video, consider joining the Link Squad using the link that's down in the description below. And as always, most importantly, spread love, because it's the Brooklyn way. Peace.